התוכנית שלנו היא תוכנית מיוחדת, והמשתתפים שלנו, חבל הזמן. אנשים מאוד אינטליגנטים, עם uh, ניסיון מאוד רלוונטי, באים מכל העולם, מארצות הברית, מאירופה, מאוסטרליה, לתרום לארץ ולחברה פה. בלי משכורת, לעבוד במשרדי ממשלה, זה משהו מאוד מאוד משמעותי להם וגם בשבילי. It has been in my heart a desire to come here, to connect with my people, to connect with the Jewish state. I want to go to Israel, I want to see how it's there, and specifically here, uh, Jerusalem. It was my dream. I am a great man. I love that there is so much history. There are many people here. I thought what better way to learn about Israel and experience Israel than to come out here, work for the government, get really into what's going on and why, and I've been loving it. I just wanted to see what it was about and get a feel for um, what, what the big deal was, and uh, then I fell in love with it. appreciate Jerusalem until you spend time with spend actual time here not as a tourist um, I mean this is the the center of monotheism it's the center of three different religions it's amazing there's so many things um, that are special about Jerusalem one of the fellows Kat and I we went to, for a walk and uh, it was kind of chilling uh, kind of dripping rainy we climbed up and uh, you could see the valley on the way to Har Hazitim and the view from there when you look down is amazing, like over the tunnel. Uh, it, it, it's, it's the most beautiful place to me to look at the new Jerusalem and the old one. And then when you look to the right, it feels like Jerusalem is coming down from heaven. It's, it's the most beautiful um, view that I've had and the most amazing feeling that I've experienced. <laughs> Nightlife is cool, it's bars and stuff. <laughs> the nightlife in Jerusalem is... Uh, somewhat of a contradiction. It's not really existent, but there's there's a little bit of an underground. So for people who look for it, it's there, but it's not the kind of nightlife that at least I would be accustomed to in the U.S. To be honest, I prefer Tel Aviv. The Israeli women are very emancipated, and I think that's a wonderful thing. Like uh, compared to other countries, especially to Europe, I really think they know what they want and I, they get what they want. Israeli guys are... they are... Ah, what's the word? Flirtatious. They're very flirtatious. Uh, flirtetanim, right? I don't know uh, what their ultimate intentions are, but of course they're fun to talk to. I'm very inspired here. I'm very inspired to, to do something, to make a change, to really get my voice heard. I'm putting together a marketing plan and uh, I'm really very much hoping that uh, they'll take some of my ideas and hopefully will let me help to bring them to life. I work in the office of the chief scientist and uh, when I came here I decided that I wanted to make a difference in um, helping to build biotechnology in Israel. Um, I work in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in the Jewish Communities Department and the Department for Combating Anti-Semitism. I've gotten to um, really dispel some of the myths that people have about Israel. Some people will be like, oh, you know, you're going into a war zone, you know, you're going into, you know, this place that is so different. But there's so many things that are very the same. And then the things that are different, I think, um, are better. There's, I think there's um, much more of a communal feel here um, where people look after each other, a sense of family, a sense of connection. that everyone's in your business all the time. I know people who hate that, but I love it. Like for instance, when everything was going on with Gaza, it was like you could make jokes with about it with people on the street. And um, you know, I'm not I'm not sure it would have had the same feelings if you were if I was in the US. Uh, I heard the sirens once when I was in the office. We found the 
shoulder quite fast and of course I was happy about the Iron Dome. איך אני יכולה לרצות לרוץ לארצות הברית כשהחברים שלי הם בצבא, שהם um, מתכוננים להילחם? זה לא פשוט. מצב בארץ ממש לא פשוט. אנחנו, ישראלים, יודעים את זה. When I told people at work I was leaving, they thought I was absolutely crazy. They were, they were telling me that, you know, I could get better thrills from bungee jumping than living in a war zone. אני אוהב את האווירה בארץ. אני אוהב להרגיש שאני יכול להיות... Uh, פול, uh, אני לא צריך um, להסתיר משהו, אני יכול uh, להיות יהודי לגמרי בגישה וערכים. I love, love, love the food. Um, I think I probably gained 10 pounds within my first two months here. What don't I like? Well, the housing prices are ridiculous. And for instance, if something is, uh, is broken here, people will just leave it. I certainly see myself living here. Just look outside and and wonder how many thousands of years ago the kind of people that walked around here and now I'm honored to be following in their footsteps. I think uh, it's a privilege uh, that um, uh, the Jewish agency in Messiah and the state of Israel work together to bring uh, the, the youth from all over the world um, to here and to connect us to our homeland. <laughs> לחיות בארץ, ולזמן ארוך, וזה היה חשוב לי, וזה מה שרציתי, אז אני באמת מרגישה שזה היה מתנה. <חל> 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 <חל>